We're on page 22 now, and we're going to go through questions 1 and 2, and we are going to write the explicit rule for the geometric sequence, and if you don't recall what the explicit rule is, or actually the formula for the explicit rule, the function of n is going to equal the first term times the rate, or the common ratio, to the power of n minus 1. So as long as we know the first term and the ratio, we're... we're we're set to go. And so if we take a look at question number one, the first term, right, the first term is going to be seven. So if one is seven, so we already know what that first term is going to be. We're going to plug it in there in a second, and then we're going to find the common ratio. So we're going to take uh, the second term divided by the first term, so 14 divided by seven, and we find out that the common ratio in this case is going to be two. And then we're going to fill this in where r is. And so uh, in this next section, let's go ahead and do that. 7, f of n equals 7, which is the first term, times the rate, which is 2, to the power of n minus 1. And so the explicit rule, I mean, it's already written there, but we're going to rewrite it again. It's going to be 7 times 2 to the power of n minus 1. And we're not solving it. Right? We're not plugging in numbers and trying to find, um, like, the sixth term or anything like that. We're just finding the explicit rule. Okay. Question number 2. So again, here's the formula for the explicit rule. The function of n equals f of 1 times uh, the rate to the power of n minus 1. And so the first term, f of n, or sorry, sorry f of 1 is going to be 128. And so let's divide the second term, 32, divided by 128. And when we do that, let me see 32 divided by 128. Uh, you're going to get 0 0.25 or 1 fourth. And so filling in the explicit rule, the f first term was what? 128 times the uh, common ratio, which in this case is 0 0.25 or 1 over 4, whichever one do you want, whichever one you want to go with, times n minus 1. So here's the explicit rule f of n equals 128 times uh, 0 0.25 to the power of n minus one. Okay, so moving on, here we are on the next page, page 23, and we're asked to, f to write the explicit rule for this geometric sequence. Okay, so again, f of 1, first term right there, which is 6, and then to find the, ratio, uh, the common ratio, we're going to divide the second term by the first term, so in this case 12 divided by 6 gives us 2, a common ratio of 2, and so let's just go ahead and fill that in. In this case, f of 1 is 6, the ratio is 2 times n minus 1, and that's where we're going to stop. Question number 2, again, identify the first term. Well, the first term is right here, it's just 1. Then the common ratio is the second term divided by the f uh, first term, which is 4 divided by 1, which gives us a common ratio of 4. And when we go ahead and write out the explicit rule based on that formula we were given, the first term was 1. The common ratio was um, 4 to the power of n minus 1.